Making big life decisions can be overwhelming and scary for a lot of us, especially when it comes to our education that will affect our future, such as choosing between a four-year college and a community college. Today, I hope to convince you and give you reasons as to why it is best to go to a community college rather than a four-year university. To start off, I want to give you the definition of the comparisons between the four-year university and community college. So what is a four-year university? According to Campus Explorer, a four-year college or university is an, is an institution that grants bachelor's degrees and can also offer associate's degrees, master's degrees, and in some cases, doctoral degrees. What is a community college? According to the Mission College website, it defines community colleges as affordable public colleges funded by tax dollars. The highest degree available at a community college is usually an associate's degree which takes full-time students about two years to complete. Now that we have that definition, we're going to go more in depth and analyze reasons why it is best to choose a community college over a four-year university. So first of all, the first point that stands out to me personally is flexibility. Just like many of us, um, we might be already working and already have a family. If that is the case, you may want to choose a community co college, and I will tell you why. At a community college, you don't have the pressure to be a full-time student. You could choose to take, to take one course at a time, whether it's because you are working or you have family. You get to choose how many courses you take and what time. Each semester, classes are provided to you beforehand so you're able to see what classes fit best for your lifestyle. Again, like I mentioned before, you could take one class the first semester and the second semester, you could decide to be a full-time student. Along with that, we all know and can agree that life happens and sometimes we not, might not have time to go to school. And that is completely okay when you are in a community college. For example, for myself, I took a one-year break and I was able to resume classes like if I never left. So that was really great for me, knowing that I'm able to resume classes without the pressure of having to re-enroll and do all the processing all over again. The second option that stands out is that most colleges are career-focused. What that means is that as well as providing degrees that four-year universities provi provide and give already such as psychology majors and accounting and all these other uh, degrees that four-year colleges have. Community colleges have career-based um, training such as medical assisting, medical office, and child care along with welding and all these other hands-on trainings that you could get a, an associate's degree in. Having these um, options broaden your uh, your career options, especially for a person that may not know what they want to dedicate their time in. At a community college, you could dip your toes in, take a class in each subject, and you could always um, explore your options, something that at a four-year university, you might feel pressured to go straight into one and stay. Here at a community college, you have that flexibility to explore your options to see what fits best for you. All in, uh, last but not least, um, the lower cost is very significant compared to the four-year university. And let me tell you why. Here I have uh, written the tuition compared to the community college and four-year university. So in California, community colleges, the average tuition is $1,246 for in-state. And if you're out of state, you would have to pay $6,603. At a four-year university, if you're an in-state student, you have to pay $6,753. Whereas if you live off, out of state, you have to pay $25,993. I don't know about you, but that seems really expensive. So knowing that a community college offers cheaper classes, flexibility, and it has more career options sounds really great right now. 
something that a four-year university may not provide for you and you would have to take out loans and do all this processing for you to even pro uh, to afford going to school. So as a review as to why you should go to community college, the flexibility of schedules may benefit you the best. You don't have that pressure to be a full-time student if you have a family and you have to provide for them or for yourself. You have that work, life, and school balance. You don't have to feel pressured being a full-time student. And also, if you're not sure what you want to study, you have that option to take classes that explore different areas that you might not have been interested in before, such as art and medical assisting and welding and construction, all these things that a four-year university might not provide. And last but not least, tuition. Um, the numbers are significantly, significantly different, something that you might be able to even pay out of pocket or just simply financial aid and, and veer off from being in debt. So, so all in all, I encourage you to see, see your options overall and see what fits you best. And I hope to, that this has helped you um, see that attending a four-year, um, excuse me, a community college is better uh, over a four-year university. Thank you.